Hi, it's Heather with Tupperware, and I want to show you our new supersonic chopper. This is our large. We also have a medium that they call the tall, and then there's the little small size, perfect for nuts and just small herbs, things like that. I love this one for smoothies. It's great, but when I want to make salsa, this is the one I'm pulling out, and it comes with a little motor that detaches at the top. It has the ring. It even has a funnel that when you turn it to the left, it locks the liquids. When you turn it right, they'll drizzle in, and there's a measurement on the inside, so if I'm making a bruschetta and I need to add oil, I can do so. Inside, you'll find a very sharp blade that's got a guard, and it also comes with a whip if I need to whip up um, a mix of some sort. I'm going to take that guard off and place that right down here, and I'm going to start by adding some onions. Depends on how much onion you like in your salsa. I've got a half of a small onion, but this is the beautiful part. You put this on, and ready, well. Four pulls, and you take a look. If you like it chunky, if you like it a little bit smaller because nobody wants the onions, then you just take and put it down to so small. Next, let's add cilantro. I keep my cilantro in my fridge smart, and it says that I need to keep it at the half breathers. That's what it says right over here, so I know how long I can keep my fridge smart much longer in here. Depends on how much cilantro you like. So we're just gonna cut off a little bit of cilantro and wash it. The reason I washed my cilantro is because when you put it away, you put it away dry and dirty, and it lasts just much longer. We're gonna just take and put that cilantro in here. If that's a lot for you, you can do a little bit, how much ever cilantro you like. So we put this in here, but I think the impressive part is watch how it chops. Sometimes I'll give it a little shake to mix up the onions. Take a peek. Look at that. Is that amazing or what? Next, I'll squeeze half a lime into my salsa. Next, we either use a can of tomatoes and rotel or fresh tomatoes. We'll take our Tupperware can opener, open the arms, it spreads the gears apart, we put it on the edge of the can, lock it, and then walk it clear around. Once you get clear around, you take the beak and simply grab the edge and pull. And lots of times what you'll see, do you see the glue that holds that can lid together? So it's not sharp when you take it off here, nor here. So we're gonna add our can of diced tomatoes and can of Rotel. The Rotel will bring the heat. So whether you like it hot, this is just regular, but you could also use the mild or the really hot. And then we're just gonna take and put our cover back on here and pull that a few times. And it mixes it up beautifully. Two ingredients left, garlic and salt. And you can use fresh garlic or regular. I like to keep mine in our Modular Mate Spice Shakers. It makes it so easy. Put your motor back on. Give it a few final pulls. As simple as starting a lawnmower. No batteries or electricity needed. Simply take the ring off. I always take and put the guard back on that blade just for safety. Then take a look at this gorgeous salsa. We'll pour it right in our clearly elegant bowl. Look at that, ready for your chips. Amazing supersonic chopper. You better get you one of those today. Have a great day.